Hey guys, Ladeo and Danielle Hart here. Hope you're doing great. Thank you so much for tuning in. We are so excited to talk about our second year experience of... Purim! <laughs> we had so much fun. This year was so awesome. So we want to share with you guys our experience, what we learned, how we felt. Our thoughts. Where did, right? where did we go? So let's jump right into it. Yeah. So this was our second year, like we said, just experiencing Perum. And I feel like this year was just a little bit different for us because we had more of an understanding of yeah. the holiday. And I think that as each year goes by, I think we're just going to have a deeper understanding, yep. a connection more to the holiday. And uh, we got to go to LA this time. You know, last year so we were cool. in our community, but we got invited by a beautiful family that's very special to us, near and dear to our hearts. And it was just so amazing just to see like, how you just there was literally like right in LA obviously LA is just it's Jewish home after Jewish home after Jewish home after Jewish home crazy so here we are and we see you know people just going into people's houses and everybody's just happy I was just so beautiful to see the community come together and just have so much you know joy and happiness and giving and love and uh, you know, seeing it from our eyes, people who are going through a conversion process, it was just so beautiful. Yeah, so for those who don't know, what is Purim? So maybe some of you guys who may live in a very, very populated Jewish community, you've seen a whole bunch of people in costumes and <laughs> lots of festivities, and, and maybe you're like, is this Halloween, but it's not in October? <laughs> like, what's going on here? So it commemorates the salvation of the Jewish people in the ancient Persian Empire from this crazy, crazy evil man named Haman. Boo! <laughs> who basically wanted to destroy, annihilate, kill all the Jewish people of that particular time. Like I said, it was like my... I would say this time was like my really my first time of experiencing reading the Megillah. Not me personally reading it, but listening to the Megillah being read and experiencing how many times we say boo for it. So <laughs> I'm still learning all of it, yeah. but it, it is, it's such a beautiful and fun experience. And that's, that's what I love about like our holidays, um, especially in, you know, in Judaism, there's just so much meaning to everything that you do, yeah. you know? So yeah, one thing that I was really excited about was Mishloach Manos. And basically, mm -hmm. this is exchanging food between friends. I had the privilege of being able to volunteer within our community and deliver these goodies to people that are in our community. It was just so much fun to be able to go to their door and to drop off different things and just the concept and the idea of, of giving. Yeah. It, it's no other comparison. It's, it's just such a beautiful feeling. And so, like he said, we, you know, got to experience not only delivering, you know, some of those goodies, but we even personally put some of those goodie bags together as well, too, which was just so fun. We just, yeah. we enjoy just serving, right? Yeah. And that's what the Jewish people are all about. It's like serving, giving, right? And um, I even had the opportunity to help my daughter, you know, put some together for her whole entire high school, uh, which was awesome. All of the high school girls and, you know, doing that with my, my daughter, it's, it's special, right? To have those times and those moments while we're talking about the holiday and then we're also putting them together and it was so much fun. And then to receive, you know, gifts as well too. It's, yeah. it's just such a beautiful thing and to see how people take the time you know, to be so thoughtful and to what they're going to put into their bag, you know, because yeah. we personally, you know, sent out some as well. And, you know, we, we thought about, okay, what are we going to put into these yeah. and what's the cards that we're going to put into them? So it's just such a beautiful opportunity to just be able to give and receive at the same time. Sure. And then on top of all that, <laughs> going to the party in LA, yeah. which was ridiculous. I yes. mean, it was this beautiful, beautiful home and they just had it decked out i mean in the front of their home they had a petting farm they had some <laughs> really cool animals there so you know our, our kids love that yeah then like on the side of their home they had a waffle station mm -hmm. they had a station where you can make holla uh, covers, holla covers. Yeah. and then in the back of the house craziness mm -hmm. i mean they had all kinds of ridiculous yeah yummy food yummy food they even had a fruit vendor as well that cut up different fruits and you can have fruit and they had an ice cream vendor with the dipping dots and crazy it was it was just so nice but like i said i think one thing that you know i was just sitting there and just taking away from that was just how open and welcoming it is it's like everybody didn't even know, you know everybody might have not known each other or yeah. they didn't even know us that we were coming and we're just welcome and we're here eating food and yeah. you know of course 
he's fulfilling the mitzvah of drinking, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, which I'm sure you want to talk about how yeah, how that was. That. that was lots of fun for you. Um, but just the uh, whole aspect of just the fun and, and what that day represented and just seeing people come together and just walking in and out, you know, coming maybe for some dessert. We There was a couple people that we seen, they were like, I'm coming to the end because I just hopped from one house to another, <laughs> right? And I guess I'll grab some dessert. So it's just, it's beautiful to see that. Yeah. It was just love. We just felt loved. We just felt we unity. We just felt, it, it was like a, if I, if I can explain it in like a word or two, it was just a breath of fresh air. You can just, yeah. you can just tell amongst the Jewish people, it was just like, this is our time to just live, just, you know, our time to just celebrate and rejoice, you know, and that's what the day is all about, yeah. you know? And just having fun, like our, our little ones were princesses, right? Yeah. And then our oldest one, my oldest daughter, she was a beautiful pirate, our oldest daughter, and then our son, Spider-Man, right? Yeah. So it's just, it's just to have fun on that day. And I know you guys are going to ask us what were, you know, what were we and our picture, I have no idea, I just... <laughs> I didn't dress up as anything. So I'm gonna be 100% honest. I was myself. I did. Uh, I was a Jabberwocky. Did. Yeah. There you right. Go. So uh, for those that don't know, a Jabberwocky, the Jabberwockies are very, very famous dancers. Right. So I love dancing, and so <laughs> they're incredible dancers. And so they wear these these cool little white masks, and then they they dance, and it's, it's really cool. So I, that was like, if you look at the thumbnail of our video, that's the mask that I had on. Yeah. And, and our uh, thumbnail, what I have on, it's like the 50s girl or something like that. That was actually your, your costume from that last year. That was my year, costume right? from last year and last year I actually had a wig with it and yeah. the whole like 50s like do up <laughs> thing. I think it was like 50s. I don't even know. I just <laughs> I had like the costume and, and got it. Yeah. yeah. I didn't do it this year. Though. Okay so my wife mentioned it earlier <laughs> that you know we, we were drinking. What's up with that right? So there, there I was not drinking. <laughs> he said drinking. we were drinking. I was not. She, right. This belly. Well, I, I say we as in me, me and the fellas. Oh, the men. Me okay. and the fellas. Gotcha. So basically, there's an obligation to drink on Purim until one reaches the point where he can no longer differentiate between cursed is Haman and blessed is Mordecai. Mm -hmm. So what does that mean? In a nutshell, <laughs> people have a good time, right? <laughs> so and we, he did. So we had, we, we had a good time. Yeah. Um, definitely, definitely a good time. We did. And like we said, um, just all the food. Uh, shout out to Lenny's and shout out to Jeff's. Woo! That was... It was amazing, absolutely. amazing food catered at that event. And yeah. it was so awesome as well to see, you know, some of our viewers that were there in oh my person. Gosh, that was and so cool. showed us so much love and, and just taking pictures. That was probably so awesome just to experience that and, and be around them as well. So if you're watching, hello. It was so <laughs> nice to meet you. We love you. Thank you for your support. Yes. It was so awesome to meet you. And yeah. we hope to meet all of you guys at some point, yeah. Mizrat Hashem, uh, but that, that was a, a big gift for us to be able to meet you guys. Yeah. So at the end of the night, we met up with some, some more of our friends and we hung out at their shul for a little bit out in LA. I had a good time laughing. More food. Uh, more food. <laughs> and it was, just, it was just incredible. It was just such an incredible time. Our kids, you know, love playing together. And then what was really cool, they had a they, they had a, an artist there who did caricatures, right? And so uh, we we all got pictures done and it, 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 they look really, really cool. So actually what we're gonna do for our members only community, we're actually gonna post those pictures on our community for members only. And uh, that I, th I think I think that would be be really, really cool. Yeah. That would put a show on what it looks like. <laughs> yeah, so and to see what you guys think. Does it look like us? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, that that'd be good. Yeah. That'd be good. So so I mean I mean that that's really that, right? It's it's kinda hard to explain and put into words our experience. So Because it is um, an experience. It's an experience. Yes. So hopefully you were able to kinda get an idea of Purim from our perspective, our lens. Mm -hmm. uh, so hopefully you guys were able to kinda kind of get some of that. So we would love to actually hear from you guys of uh, your experiences of what Perm was for you. Like yes. We love hearing different, you know, stories and we got to see uh, clips and videos of uh, how it is in Israel. Oh my gosh, we cannot wait to Next experience level. Next level. <laughs> Perm in Israel. So um, yeah, let us know your experiences. We'll love that. Put it in the comments. Put it in the comments, yeah. You know, share, share whatever you want to share, but we, we love. And plus that'll give us a chance to really just maybe even broaden our perspective and to be able to to see Purim 
from your point of view and to learn different things and like, oh, wow, they did this yeah. and they did that. And so that just adds more to, uh, to our understanding. So that'd be great. We would appreciate it. So that's a wrap. That's it. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy our videos, we would greatly appreciate if you like it. And if you want to take it a step further, feel free to subscribe and turn on your notification if you want to take it a step further. And that way, every time we post a video, you'll know. You'll be able to stay in the loop. And if you want to take it a step further, we have a membership community called Team Elevate. And listen, we've been having a phenomenal time. And we created this community so that we can build an even deeper connection and a relationship with all of you guys. So if, so if that's something that you wanna look into, we'll be sure to leave a link down below in the comments mm -hmm. and you can take a look and don't feel obligated, but it's just some extra stuff. We post extra videos, like I said, we're gonna post the pictures of our caricatures on there. Mm -hmm. And you know, we have- We, we do personal lives. We do lives we do every lives. single Thursday with our members only. Yep. And that's just, you know, people asking questions and we're connecting and we might have certain topics that we're talking about as well too, as far as like, you know, things with our conversion and you know, how's it going and- Deeper, it's just, deeper it's stuff. It's just deeper stuff. Yeah. And it's, it's beautiful because we are building that community aspect and that relationship. And we just created a WhatsApp group for our community. So that's super, super cool. So we've been, you know, talking to a lot of you guys and just kicking it. So it's awesome. So check so out. So many perks. So, so many perks. perks that come with, you know, being a member. Yeah. So we'll make sure we link below. And that's it. You got anything else? That's it. Thank you guys so much. We love you. We appreciate you watching. Have a great day.